This is actually part two of the flying Sikh, an extract taken from an autobiography written by Mika Singh. And the title of the autobiography is The Race of My Life, written in 2013 and co-authored with his daughter Sonia Sangalka. And now we are continuing with the same in this part two. In the part first, author uh, has given us, uh, as you know, that experience happened with his sister and uh, when he uh, was there in that the national games and he won that race but finally his uh, sister was not happy with all that struggle and hard work he had been doing so here that second very important incident um, or the event is narrated by the author and this is the uh, the best achievement uh, in his life the national games were held for three days and in that he told us that he received so many uh, that titles or the awards in that uh, he set new records 100 meters the in 10.4 seconds then 200 meters then 400 meters race and all he secured that record, new record. And finally, uh, he uh, explained how his visit to Pakistan was the uh, historical event in his life. And what happened actually when he visited Pakistan for the first time for some event. So um, what was that experience? Let us discuss. After national games, his team was there invited from the Pakistani government for the Indo Park Sports Meet. And that was actually very ironic twist according to author in his life. Twist of fate, he said. Twist of uh, luck, he said. So, he was returning to the land where he was born. So, he didn't want to go to Pakistan because in the childhood, he suffered a lot at that place, Lailpur, or the uh, that birthplace of his. Because while that pre-independence uh, movement was going on, and uh, that in that struggle, so many people they suffer due to that partition and the riots in Punjab. So undivided India, uh, that part Lailpur, he was living in gave him so many memories but later on when he came to this part of india and uh, he left that pakistan for the first time he was returning uh, for that pakistan indo park uh, sports meet he did not want to go actually but pandit nehru uh, again told him that uh, the visit is very important because it is honor for our country and uh, he is going as an ambassador. So in this way, due to the Pandit Nehru Trust Singh, he uh, again, uh, he had to go to that place where he didn't want to go. The others in our team felt as I did. So here what uh, Milka Singh told that nobody was ready to go to Pakistan everybody was reluctant because that was the period everybody was having bad experience about Pakistan so we reluctantly traveled he said and uh, at the border of Atari via Amritsar then that welcoming committee welcomed all these sportsmen at that border then they were taken by bus to one hotel at Lahore in Lahore that hotel's name is Faletti Hotel and after that means uh, they stayed at that hotel. Days before the meet opened uh, that headlines in the newspaper were also flashed and uh, that headline was Indo Park Athlete Duel Abdul Khalid to meet Milka Singh. So it was actually that uh, very important event for both uh, that Milka Singh and that uh, Abdul Khalid. So the meet was declared open by President of Pakistan General Ayub Khan at the newly constructed Gaddafi Stadium. 
there were more than 30,000 spectators in the men's enclosure and several thousand of burqa clad ladies in the women's. The, who were there in that stadium, Gaddafi Stadium? 30,000 spectators. In that, several thousands of burqa clad ladies were also there. So, in this way, that um, whole event was going to happen. The general, other senior officials, and their families sat comfortably in the presidential box. So it was the scene actually uh, very uh, simply this author is creating before us. And what type of um, that all event happened um, here that is expressed in these words. At this event I was once again pitted against my old opponent Abdul Khalid. Here Milka Singh told us that it was the second time he was there before that Abdul Khalid because in uh, that, that Tokyo games he defeated Abdul Khalid. He had defeated that uh, Khalid. But here for that second time he was meeting Abdul Khalid in Pakistan. So um, consequently all those people in that crowd were very um, that um, excited and they wanted something different in this uh, that their hero would defeat me and they can get the revenge out of that that was the feeling of all Pakistanis sitting in that stadium so in this way this was actually that uh, sport war between two countries all those spectators they were uh, shouting like long live Pakistan long live Abdul Khalid entire audience was cheering for him and uh, here it was challenging thing for Milka Singh and uh, at the starting line um, here he put down uh, his bag warmed up and wiped the, that um, perspiration from his body with a towel actually Milka Singh's health was also not good at that time he was having that feverish uh, that condition and uh, he felt that that is due to the that uh, his previous experiences in Pakistan how he uh, his family suffered how he lost his home how he lost his family all that inhuman savagery during that partition everything that religious um, bigotry that troubled him so everything that past moments moments in his life gave him that feeling of uh, some sadness in his mind and due to that he had a fever 